Hello, today I have great news, and that is we have a new compression method. I have to give a shout out to AgLab for first porting this to Mari64 and then Red for porting this to my repo. And um, this one is actually pretty cool to have. So this only saves around 0.1% of ROM size, which is not a lot at all. But it is a little bit faster. And I mean, 0.1% is great, actually. Because we are at 61.6 .6 megabytes now which means there's only 2.4 megabytes left for us to play with if we want to fit within the 64 megabyte limit, which I think it would be really sad if we went over that. So I'm going to do my best to actually fit in there. Uh, keep in mind, out of those 61.6 megabytes, around 49 megabytes is audio, which means only around 12.6 megabytes is actually the game. So we can add around 20% more content to the game if we wanted to, which I do think is sufficient. But worst case, we might have to trim back on some of the streamed audio. Maybe we have to import one song at a sample rate of 22,000 hertz instead of 32,000. So that will be fine. Uh, I also want to say after Red added this to my repo, I went over it a little bit. I optimized it a little bit specifically for the N64. This is a part of a very famous algorithm, which is uh, lip deflate with a Huffman layer. I think that's what it's called. So the main optimization I did is I added dirtying the cache lines, which means we save around half of memory traffic. Unfortunately, this is loading time. So during loading time, the RDP is not rendering anything, meaning that we have the entire RAM bus to ourselves anyway. So saving the dirtying of cache lines like this is not as big an optimization as you'd hope, but it's still a decent speed improvement. Plus, I made sure this all fits into one block of iCache and it's continuous in memory. As you know, I would usually do that. This makes the whole code run like, what, eight times faster. Although I think AgLab already had that mostly locked down. So again, this is not a big optimization. I think at most I had like a 5% speed up. The problem is when I ported this, I still had the bug that made my loading times take like an extra 180 VIs for iterating the entire RAM for no reason because of some compiler behavior I didn't understand at the time. But yeah, pretty happy with this. That's it. Bye-bye.